quarter to one in the morning. I can't believe I'm getting away with staying out this late. What shall I do now? Jane Jessica Barrett, what do you think you're doing out here at this time of night? I was just hanging out, Mum. Young lady, you do not hang out at ten to one in the morning. You are supposed to be at home and bed. But Mum, there's no school tomorrow. It's an inset day. You know perfectly well it is not an inset day tomorrow because you have that test. You're a naughty young lady. Why am I naughty? You're naughty because you're out here at stupid o'clock and not at home and in bed like you should be. Mum, I know what you're gonna say next. I'm grounded, right? Too right you are, young lady. You are grounded for two weeks. When we get home we are going to get you ready and put you straight to bed. Naughty girl. Okay, I hope you do well in that test today, Jane. Me too, Mum. I'm gonna have to ask you to remember that you're grounded, and that means no hanging out after school. You are to come straight home. Understood? Yes, Mum. Don't keep on about it, for Fox's sake. If you talk that way again, I will ground you more. Watch your mouth. Aha. Uh -huh. Bargain Hunt 2045. Excellent. I love this show. Hi, Mum. Hi, Millie. What can I do for you, darling daughter? Actually, I was just hoping I could talk to you. Of course, darling. Sit down. What's on your mind? Well, to be honest with you, it's James. James? What's wrong with him? He has been feeling down for the past two weeks now. I can see him getting worse before my very eyes and I'm really worried about him. Oh no. Poor thing. Where is he now? Hey mum. Millie. Hi James, my poor darling brother. James, come and sit down my poor darling son. So darling? Why are you feeling so down? Well, Mum, I... Come on, sweetheart. Tell me, I'm your mother. I really don't know, Mum. I just... James, darling. You're my son. I love you so much that it breaks my heart to see you like this. We need to cheer you up. I know, Mum. But how are we going to do that? Well, for starters we need to know what's caused you to feel sad like this. It's my eye travel device. It's malfunctioning all the time and it's very close to having it. Oh no. You poor thing. I totally understand how you feel. Apple have been slacking with their devices recently. I know. So, how are we going to cheer me up? I could buy you the iTravel2 device. It's brand new. Doesn't that cost between £950 and £3000 dependent on where you buy it? It does normally but Curry's have got it in for just under £500, and I can afford to replace your old iTravel one with it. If you want it. Yes. Please. Of course I want it, Mum. You totally know how to cheer me up. Thank you. You're very welcome, darling. I knew I could put a smile on your face, son. Well done, darling. That was excellent. You really think so, Mummy? Molly, darling. Please sit down. I know your dancing is great. It's the best dancing I've ever seen. I tell you this because you're my daughter and I love you. I love you too, Mummy. I mean, I really love you. What did you just say? I really love you. Molly Tamara Barrett, you do not use that language. You're naughty. No, I'm not. You're very naughty. Go to your room and think about what you've just said. 